Kramnik, you're now in the lead of this tournament. What are your thoughts about that? Well, of course, uh, it's still, you know, just uh, only half of the tournament and the lead is very small in just half point. So I don't really care so much about it. But of course, winning a game against such a strong player like Fabiano is, is always nice. Although I have to admit it was a bit lucky. I mean, I pressed. I mean, I was better the whole game, but he defended well and normally it should have been a draw and probably just got tired by the end and made a, quite a serious blunder. So yeah, I had some luck today, I have to say. So you're not happy? No, I'm happy, but I'm usually more happy to win, you know, uh, normally to win because I play better, not because I'm luckier. Yeah, but uh, anyway, I mean, of course I'm happy, but I'm also tired. It was a long game and uh, a tough game. So, yeah, no, everything for the moment, everything is going well, but I'm not really thinking yet about winning a tournament. It's a bit too early to think about it. Your next game is against uh, Topolo. How do you th feel about that? Well, I mean, uh, every game with Black here is not easy, and uh, of course he's a dangerous player, although he's in the last position now, but he can always strike, you know, so, uh, and usually our games are very entertaining most of the time, so yeah, I'm waiting, I'm looking forward for a fight, and uh, we will see how it will end, but uh, uh, in general the main uh, concern is to, after this tough game today, just to, to recover well and to be fresh tomorrow. With the toilet gate incident in mind, how is your relationship to Topala? No, they're not great, I have to admit. Uh, and uh, well, I don't, don't really see much potential of getting better the relations, but it's okay. We, we still can play chess. Do you want to make peace with him? No. <laughs> <laughs> Will you shake his hand tomorrow? I don't think so. <laughs> Why not? Well, I just don't respect him as a person. I mean, I respect him as a chess player very much, but I think his behavior there was really awful and uh, totally unsportive. And uh, since he never apologized for it, I, I, well, I know it's a matter of principle. I'm not going to shake his hand. Mm -hmm. But how is it sitting across uh, a chessboard hours in and hours out with a man you don't respect? Oh, it's okay, you know, it's uh, it's business, nothing personal. <laughs> in, in many areas you have to deal with people you don't respect, so it's okay. No, anyway, but of course he's a strong opponent, so I, I don't care. I mean, I just play a game against him, so... Uh, and when I play chess anyway, it's never personal for me. I just, you know, once I play, uh, once it starts, it's just a game of chess. So I don't, for me, it doesn't matter if I play against friend or against somebody whom I don't like. It's the same for me. But if it wasn't personal, why won't you shook his hand? No, it's just a matter of, no, no, I mean, just a matter, it, it has nothing to do with chess. I mean, I'm not shaking his hand in any situation anyway, you know, not even when I play chess. I mean, for me, chess and, and, and uh, let's say, a human life is just, I separate it very clearly. I mean, so it has absolutely nothing to do with chess. It's just simply, I'm not shaking his hand because I, I will not, I would not do it under any circumstances. That's it, not even, uh, even if we meet. No, but it's okay anyway. It's, uh, well, it's a story, well, which is uh, uh, already old and I, I am not emotional about it. It's just simply okay. I just don't want to to deal with him. That's it. You know, in on a human basis. But but uh, there is no problem for me playing chess with him. Good luck tomorrow. Thank you.